fellow Luffians, Squealer back here with you, and I'm hoping to make a third consecutive successful challenge run. In this one, it's just Maximum Guy, and a while back I had decided to try a start from scratch, no instant death, kill every enemy run with Maxim and Dakar. And eventually, I was able to complete it. And when I did complete it, I realized that if I had good luck, it would be possible to do it with Guy, who's just really a lesser version of Dakar. So far, weapons aren't real great. I've been swapping around depending on what I need elementally. Uh, technically, Bronze Axe is my best for Guy, and Rock Breaker my best for Maxim, which is pretty poor at this point. Usually you've got like some of those elemental weapons that start showing up in the 20s, like Mist Rapier, Red Saber, Free Sword. Well, maybe not Free Sword yet, but you get the idea. But what I have had good luck with are jewels. I've got a B-Rock and a Gold Eye, which are two of the key jewels that you need in a start from scratch run in beating blue mimics. Right now I've got my IP jacked up so I just have to th hope that on this floor, this is the first floor where mimics start appearing, that there aren't too many mimics per sprite. So this could be the turning point in my run. Still a lot of things could happen, but let's see. And none of my characters, of course, are faster than a blue mix at this point. So I'll make sure to have Maxim heal and Guy do Stardust Blow. And what I'll try to do is swap. Ooh. I will try to swap that gold eye back and forth, I think, with the Stardust Blow, and hopefully it takes them out every time. Okay, that one worked. And I'll keep these guys around. Oh yeah, there's a... this is handy. Forgot about that. I'll keep the other enemies around just to help me get my IP up if necessary. Now, B-Rock is good too because it freezes them or paralyzes whatever. And I don't know that Maxim is powerful enough to take him out with one shot, but we shall see. Alright, excellent. This is really what I was hoping for. And even Darby gets in on that one. And there was one more on this floor. Some of the other enemies that I'm not looking forward to, well right now, some of the tough undead enemies because I only have two gladius or gladii, whatever the plural is of gladius. Hmm. Well, and then another key here is that Guy can't heal. Like in the other situation, I could have Maxim heal with Champion and Guy do the Stardust Blow. But this way. Let's see. Well, and just to make sure, maybe this will do it. A big boomer in addition. Cross your fingers. Ooh, not good. Stay alive. Man, that was close. Let's see how many actual HP. Dang. That was more powerful than guys. Anyway, let's see how many he actually has. 14. Close call. Oh wait, what am I doing? I don't need to heal. Got my HP pad.
and I'm going to spare you from these easier battles and come back for the next blue mimics, assuming there are any. Sometimes you get lucky. Alrighty. I'm on the next floor now, and I'm actually about to get into a dangerous fight. Dangerous because I'm not sure Maxim takes one of these out with a Gladius. Plus, Guy is slower than these guys, and these guys can insta-kill you, or confuse, and if they confuse Guy, that is dangerous. Okay, that's a good start. That bite is what can confuse you. Okay. And you say, that looks simple. Again, it's just... When they do status effect attacks, that's what can really bite you. So to speak. By the way, with those remaining enemies on that previous floor, since I had an HP pad right there, I went ahead and let them beat up on me a little bit. I let the gnomes surprise attack me. And then some of the other enemies got some licks in. Okay. Wow. He must still have the B-Rock on him? I must have forgot to switch. Yep. Yeah. See, now that's dangerous. I mean, it worked out for the better there, of course, but... That's one of the ways that I die sometimes, is forgetting to change equipment back. Of course, it's not that big of a deal in this case, but when you're trying to decide what weapon to use, it can end your run. Come on. Okay, looks like no blue mimics on this floor. I'll beat these rest of these guys and be back. Alright, and here's the third and final floor where mimics appear. And I'm still looking for some equipment upgrades. That'll help. And so far, that's my only weapon with a decent thunder attack, which I might need it if uh, I don't get a sky sword or boom sword for those orkies. So far, so good. That's actually a really nice pickup as long as I can find a curse lifter to go with it. Let me check something here. Maybe I've already passed the blue mimics because. Those plants, can't remember what they're called. They're not red plants, the other thing. May have replaced them. I've got my little cheat sheet here. It says Blue Mimics. Agility 132. HP 365. Start appearing on floor 29, so I guess I'm past them. Anyway, this is just part one in what hopefully is a successful run. Keenid. With Guy. Thanks.